G'day, welcome to the Edit Studio where I do all my videos. Uh, the reason I'm making this video is because I just spotted something on Banggood and it gave me a chuckle. Um, it is a Free Sky product, apparently it says Free Sky super new lightweight 100% UV rays blocking sunglasses for outdoor FPV. <laughs> Seriously, sunglasses for FPV. I want to know, do you wear them over your goggles or under your goggles? Really seriously? Is this, is this for real? Is this, it's not April the 1st, is it? FPV sunglasses. Yeah, and the thing is they're $58 New Zealand, which must be like $32, $34 US. And they don't look like a particularly high quality set of sunglasses. If I look at the images, they are just sort of like three pieces of plastic and the arms clip into the fronts and it all looks a bit airy fairy. And I don't think they're polarized. And that's really important with sunglasses. Now, if you're gonna use sunglasses, and I recommend you do flying line of sight, and when there's any kind of sun or glare around, get polarized. I think I did a video on this already. There may be a, if I can find it, I'll link to it in the description, but polarized sunglasses make the world of difference. They really enable you to tilt your head and get the model to pop against the background of blue sky. It makes a world of difference. Trust me, try them. You'll never go back to ordinary sunglasses once you've tried polarized sunglasses when you're flying line of sight. But uh, seeing this product here on Banggood, I thought, well, yeah, is it is it genuine or is it a ripoff? I went to the Free Sky website to see if there was any mention of it there, and there wasn't any mention on Free Sky's website. There's no mention of sunglasses. So maybe it's a knockoff being sold under the Free Sky brand because I really don't think Free Sky should be focusing on sunglasses or eyewear or hats or anything. They should be focusing on giving us good quality RC products and not trying to back us into a corner with new protocols. And on that subject, something really worrying that I just read while I was looking through this stuff. Now, let me read this out to you. It's about it's a free sky announcement, 21st of February 2019, so it's quite old. I don't know if anyone else has picked up on this, but it says, recently we have come across many counterfeits in the market. Some illegitimate manufacturers are utilizing the free sky brand and free sky intellectual property in the unlicensed production and sale without the permission or license from free sky. If you believe you have purchased one of these unauthorized products and proceed to use it with our transmitters, then the user this is Chinese, then the user risks an unreliable signal resulting in the possible loss of your model. Furthermore, these products and some so-called authorized FreeSky compatible products will become rendered incompatible with FreeSky's authorized products and FreeSky's latest firmware updates soon. What did I tell you about them trying to lock out competition? And this speaks to the access protocol. Remember, I spoke about the access protocol. Here is their, their own statement that they're trying to lock out these competitors, these people that are making compatible receivers to their transmitters. I told you that in the video on the, uh, what is it, X9 Lite or 9X Lite or whatever it was. Here's their own admission of that. I'm unhappy with Free Sky. Yeah, sure, if people are directly copying your designs and your firmware, that's fine. If they are creating compatible products that are inspired by Free Sky, no, don't do it. And, stop, and, and what about these sunglasses? Are they genuine or are they fakes? I don't know. Free Sky is starting to lose its way. It really needs to focus not on creating new stuff to protect itself in the market. The best way Free Sky can protect itself in the market is to make the best product at the best price. If they can't do that, they're going to lose because that's what customers want. The best product at the best price. Don't waste your money trying to lock people out of the market, other companies out of the market, because that's money you should be using on R&D and keeping your costs down. There you go. Just a bit of advice to Free Sky. And well, what do you think? Put your answers in the comments. You going to buy some of those Free Sky glasses? If you are, <laughs> <laughs> You're mad. You're mad. Absolutely mad. But probably not Frisco anyway. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Get it back back to the edit. Got lots of videos coming up soon. And I'll give you a tour of the edit studio at some stage in the near future so you can see what I do and the tools I use. Anyway, bye for now.